I am super excited to show you guys the bathroom. The tile guy got not as much done today as I would have thought, but he's still got quite a bit on the walls and I'm excited to show you guys. Austin's actually seen this bathroom for the first time. We just showed him the Alexa fan that we put in. because That's pretty dang cool, which it is. All right, Austin, how are you feeling about this bathroom? Guys, welcome back to our channel. Thanks for hanging out with us. Owen has been helping me on this bathroom project. He helped me demo the floor, helped me demo the shower, all the, the sheetrock, all the tile, and it was just an absolute mess. But he's got quite a few hours into it, and I definitely appreciate the help. I told him I would pay him, and tonight he's gonna cash in those coins. Owen is gonna get his first what? Bowling ball. Bowling ball and bowling shoes. Every time you go bowling, they charge you to rent the shoes. And so it just makes sense to get those because he goes quite a bit. But we went in there last night, had a look around. It was officially closed, but they let us go in to the pro shop or whatever they call it. And we had a look at the balls, we had a look at the shoes. And tonight we're gonna go down and make our final selection. They're gonna get that ball off the shelf and drill some holes in it. And uh, maybe an O and I will throw a couple rounds of bowling and uh, see what happens. What you want to do is you'll find where it, it, your finger drops in, goes into the first knuckle piece. So for me, that's the size I want. See how I can't get into this one quite? This one I can go past that knuckle piece. That's what you want to do for both of your fingers. They won't be next to each other. So you'll probably be up in this range. Drop down one, drop down one. All right, so I'll go right there for now. We can change these after we put them in the ball too. So 21 for that one and then middle finger. And we'll go up to here. All right, so Owen is going to get that one ball that we showed you guys. They just measured his fingers, and he's going to try and pick out some shoes right now. So he's kind of looking to see what's on the list here, and then uh, we're going to search up above here on the shelf and see if we can get a found. He keeps taking a lot of those. So I was trying to flip the camera. Yeah. All right, we got to try out Owen's new toy. So uh, we're going to play a couple games right now. He's just lacing up his new shoes, and then it's game on. Putting in the good clips. <laughs> All right, here we go. First throw with the brand new ball, brand new shoes. Ah! Owen's buddy showed up who also have their own balls and shoes and they're gonna bowl a few more games. Uh, I'm gonna head home and uh, check on mom and the girls. I am just getting home from the bowling alley and oh my gosh, almost got hit with something. Claire also got home. I forgot that she had a birthday party tonight. Claire, what did you guys go do? We went to Elastic Skating. Okay. Did you ride rollerblades or roller skates? Roller blades. Oh, really? That's good because I cannot do roller skates. Me either. Absolutely terrible at them. Did you guys like win all this stuff or was it just this well, so little bag they gave to you? There was a bag that had most of the stuff, but I won this. Oh, really? I won these. Finger handcuffs. Wow. I won. Really secure. This. The Chinese finger traps. I got this one for coming. And then, what else one did I win? I won. Did you win the eye patch or did that come in the back? Carmen, let's see. I Carmen, won. look at me. <laughs> two bouncy balls. Three. I won That's a two. lot of stuff. And I won this topper. Oh. Oh, that was not a very good one. I this one's my favorite. Oh, yeah. Those like poppy things. You're supposed to do it off your phone, my Okay, let's see. Oh. <laughs> the topper, I can do it great. Okay, give it a shot. Nice. The girls are gonna play with those fun little toys for a second. I have gotta get these things on right here. They are faucet protectors for outside. Um, we had a great January, super nice as Terry said. The other day was really warm. However, it has turned out really cold. We're looking at a low of like seven to nine degrees tonight. So I hope I'm not too late, but I gotta get outside and quickly get these things put back on. And then we're gonna show you guys the bathroom. The towel guy got pretty far today. So we wanna show you guys that. All right, Clay ran outside to put that thing on the faucet so it does not freeze we do not need to have that thing freeze and break I am super excited to show you guys the bathroom the tile guy got not as much done today as I would have thought but he still got quite a bit on the walls and I'm excited to show you guys Austin's actually seen this bathroom for the first time we just showed him the Alexa fan that we put in 
because that's pretty dang cool, which it is. All right, Austin, how are you feeling about this bathroom? It's definitely an upgrade for sure. <laughs> <laughs> looks pretty good, huh? Yeah, it looks sick. The tile's dope. I can tile. So we got this whole back wall done today, and then half of this wall all put on. Almost over toward the vanity, actually, we'll meet up with it right so here that, on this end. That's what this piece of wood is for. So this is the edge of the vanity. So tiles can come to here or set up on top. I've never done it this way, but I'm trying to save the tile guys from coming back. Gonna have them just set this piece of wood, then I'll put my cabinet in and then just slip my countertop underneath it just right. So everything's gotta be perfect. I'm hoping that works out. I'll have to just cut the corner of the countertop to fit around the tile, but I can do that. I can make that happen. So then he'll just follow this line up here, right there. So ball cabinet, base cabinet, tile will come over. I'm still kind of debating whether we should run tile down this wall or not. So I don't think the tile guy would like that because he's been having to put a ton of mud on these walls just because they weren't straight, you know, and I didn't change these walls. It's just how they were, but I don't know. I, I don't just, know. I, I like the like... thought of having it all tiled. That way you're not getting any moisture on the walls dripping down. I feel like it'll really like make it feel closed in though. So yeah. I want to leave this wall just I'll paint it white with the rest of the house. This wall, well, right here anyways, towel rack, white, and then the tile, we'll start with that blue stuff starts. If we're gonna do that, have it. I don't feel like we can paint the same color yet. I don't know, I'd have to look at it as well, like, is painted out here, I think that's gonna be too yellow. I think the white's almost gonna have to match the tile or they're gonna clash. Yeah, I agree. So maybe we'll take the tile and have it like match somehow or something, I don't know. We'll figure that out later. But I do like the idea of leaving these two walls open. The guy's doing a good job though. Like if you look at these lines up top, I mean, that's pretty tight and he's cutting this with a grinder. He didn't like go rent the big saw that he thought he was going to. So he's cutting this by hand with his grinder and that's pretty tight. I mean, with like less than an eighth, some of it's an eighth, but most of it's less, like a 16th. Pretty yeah. impressive. He's doing a great job with it, for sure. You excited to shower in here? <laughs> <laughs> We're checking out the mirror that I bought. I've had this mirror for months. I bought it from Ikea a long time ago. We're gonna actually use it in our master bathroom, but it's too big. So we saved it for in here, and it's gonna fit just about perfectly. It really is. I was worried it wasn't gonna fit because we kind of made the vanity a little smaller than it used to be, but. That's amazing. I think it's gonna work. You like it? You wanna keep it? I don't know. Should we keep it? Should we switch it up? Let us know. <laughs> Alright guys, now that Owen has his own ball, he wants to join a bowling league with his buddies. I was on a bowling league as a kid for one year, but it was a fun thing to do during the winters in Wyoming because it was cold and long and it was a great activity after school. But Owen and his buddies are good. His are one good. friend now has two balls, <laughs> a spare ball and a regular ball. I didn't know there was that much to know about bowling, but when we walked in the pro shop, there was like all the hand guards and like all these other random weird things. I thought it was just like rent a pair of shoes and grab a ball and Me too. throw it down the lane. <laughs> Apparently not. There's some signs behind it. Some people take it like very seriously. Yes, they do. Guys, tomorrow, Terry has her very first physical therapy appointment, bright and early in the morning. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to it. Yes. Not gonna um, lie. She tried to get a more reasonable time, but they are very booked up. And so she took an early morning just to get started on it. And I don't think Austin's is, is until the end of the week. Friday, he goes Friday. in. Friday. Yes, so. In a few days. So I don't, I'm not gonna be able to get up and go with her because I gotta make sure the girls get to school. So I told Terry, you better have those guys film you. <laughs> and you just gonna have to tell them, hey guys, I'm pretty popular. My name is Terry from the <laughs> Camille fam. If you guys could just film me while I do this, that'd be great. They'll definitely do it, I'm sure. They have nothing better to do with their time. <laughs> Probably charge us double, actually. So guys, thanks for watching. We love you. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow.